And this morning, a warm start for a lot of us. The few that is just staying a little bit on the cooler side. We're seeing Sterling City sitting at 47. So a combination of these warm temperatures plus dew points. Uh, we are seeing them also in the low 50s. The combination of these two things are giving us some low-level clouds forming, so we are seeing some fog for quite a bit of the Contra Valley. We are under a dense fog advisory till 10 o'clock this morning, so you definitely want to be weather aware and careful as you're headed out the door this morning because we're seeing some visibility getting a little bit lower throughout this morning, but we'll start to clear those out as we go through the afternoon and get them a little bit warmer as well. We're going to be getting into to the highs of 77 for us. Plenty of sunshine. It's a nice day out there, but we'll see clouds rolling in for Wednesday. Warm temperatures still sticking around for Wednesday. We'll actually see upper 70s again before a cold front that's going to be coming through on Thursday. That's giving us some rain chances. It is going to be just rain for us. Now, this front does stall out just south of us, so we'll see moisture coming in. We'll see cooler air for us, but that's going to be short-lived because then it's going to push back north, getting us warm air back into our area as we go into Friday, and then Friday we will see one or two actual storms possible for that day because of such warm air we've had throughout the entire week. We'll see that cold front that's going to be pushing through the rest of the afternoon and evening of your Friday, and we'll start to clear it out and cool it off for the weekend. Now, I did mention we could see a storm or two for your Thursday night into your Friday. We are under a non-severe uh, weather threat out there, but we could see one or two storms push through that give us a little bit of some stronger winds and a little bit of more rainfall as well. So that morning commute, you might want to add a couple more minutes on Friday. But until that happens, pretty nice few days after we get rid of all that fog this morning. We'll still keep the warm temperatures with those 50s getting us into the upper 70s and continue till that first cold front on Thursday cools us back down. Then we'll see that warm up into those 70s on Friday. And we're definitely going to be seeing a nice more January-like conditions on our Wednesday with some 60s coming back after that cold front.